Ah, uh, we're now on emergency war footing. As uh, Keith E has been banned from a YouTube channel, and I'm here to investigate on a new episode of Lance Investigates. What's going on? Uh, so, uh, who, uh, local channel, put up a horrible video. I told them it stunk and they should redo it. A local channel? Do you mean local to your house? So you're banned for being a critic. Well, everybody's entitled to an opinion. Uh, yeah, I think that kind of sucks, man. Uh, listen, people can put shitty comments below my videos. I always try and have a discussion with people. But unless people are pers making it personal, personally attacking me, they can say my content sucks. It's fine. Everyone has got an opinion. Opinions are like assholes. Everyone has one. So um, I am now eating a ginger biscuit. Okay. So, guys. Let us resume the conquest of the universe. Um, as I know how important it is to my core audience of three people um, that you see me complete this mission in good time. So, first of all, we are going to share the entire screen so that you can see everything. Um, there we go. Hello. And that's kind of like a goldfish thing. If you look, there's a screen within a screen within a screen in that shot. Yeah, man, you've been bitched at by more important people like me, for example. Um, I'm just kidding there. All right. Let's, um, let's go and conquer the universe. Okay, cool. So I am eating cookie. So occasionally my mouth will be a bit full. All right. Here we are. Here we are. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. I can't remember the lyrics to that Queen song, but, you know, Champions of the Universe or something. Okay. So... Um, we're coming into land. Um, we're going to complete our conquest of the Mechlon Scourge. Can we believe I played this for like, um, I think it was five hours yesterday. A long time. Um, but, you know... Holidays are tough because it kind of, if you don't have family, it's not a good time because it kind of reminds you of that. Okay. Um, and chat, just to warn you, my phone is currently on charge. I'm going to leave it for a little bit before I start commenting on the chat. But I'm going to assume that I've done this correctly and you can all see it. Oh, look, there's some pollution on SETI Prime. So we better get our anti-pollution shit going on. Let's build a Recyclotron. I'll address that. I'm going to recycle everything. I'm going to buy that straight away. There we go. All right. Um, damn, well, this guy has just been conquered. Just going to put that in here for the minute, I think. Could build him a cloning center. Why don't we do that? Plenty of room on that planet, right? Yeah, let's do that. Build, build the cloning center. See if he can start being a bit more productive. Fleet needs orders. <coughs> <clears throat> oh dear. So, just to recap, we are currently um, besieging Yarrow Prime here. Um, we've defeated most of the Klaxon forces. Uh, Going to defeat some more right now. 
yeah, see you later. Civilian ships, oh dear. Um, uh, I'm going to take that guy out if we can. I'm going to auto resolve this combat. Ooh, wasn't convinced we were going to win that one, but we did. Okay. So, on this side of the galaxy, all Mechlon forces have been eliminated. Just, just saying. We now control completely this side of the universe. Um, that is an enemy space station. There's still a few of them about... Uh, that's one of mine. I don't think we need that, so we're going to scrap that. No. Uh, again, I don't think we need this either. Because these cost a lot of money per turn. Uh, you only get one command point from them. So, whereas star bases and so on are, are, are better for that. So this destroyer's just taken a bit of a battering, so he's going to come back to here. Uh, I think that's it for this side. I think we're pretty much done. Some more troop transports there. I guess these guys are coming up to the front line, but and I guess these guys should also come up to the front line. Um, cool. All right. <coughs> yeah, I'm still got this heavy mucus on my chest. Just won't go, you know. Right, as we can see, pollution here is uh, quite prominent. So let's let's get some stuff for that. Uh, mm, there is nothing that we can. So unless we take people off production, uh, there's no. I can't. I mean, weather does that help reduce pollution? Not really. No, well, not really. No, no, it doesn't. So, I think what we need to do is um, take a couple of people off research here to reduce the pollution level. Just knocked it down a little bit. Buy that. Is there anything I can dismantle that will reduce? Um, probably don't need the cloning center, so we can get rid of that. Uh, I don't think that's helped though. Um, we don't need the auto lab. Mm. Don't need the pleasure dome either. Your mechlars, you don't need a pleasure dome. Alright. <clears throat> well, pollution levels are minus 22. That's better than it was. Okay, so the front line here. Yeah, we're we're crushing the Mechlon from two fronts. We have occupied Mechlon Prime. We're sieging the other city. Um, Harbour is probably their last stronghold really uh, once I take that um, yeah they're pretty much done bring these to here I think we're good I think we're good again we can probably start dismantling a lot of these um, military outposts, but I'm going to refrain for the moment. Hmm. We've built some frigates here. Transports. 
Where are they going next? Is a question. Oh yeah, for Mechlon. All right. That's it. Time for a next turn. I'll have a quick look at the phone, make sure this is working properly. Okay, stream is working good. I see the chat. Either Daryl or Keith is still in there. I'm not sure who. Anyway, we shall continue with this quest. This conquest of space. Um, I think we're nearly done here. But let's, uh, let's see. Let's go to Yarrow and see what we have to do here first. Hmm, not sure that we want to let any Alkiri in here. So, I'm going to do a bit of a blocking, uh, a bit of a blocking situation. But first, we want to move those transports over to Yarrow too. And then we, I think we also want some on Yarrow Prime because there's no transports there. So I'm going to split these between those two destinations. Oh, we got three. I thought there were more, but... No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, all right. Well, let's um just take uh, let's take a few ships over to here first. Okay, that's obviously got defences, so we're gonna need more than that. Right, let's do and add that to that ratio. Fine. And let's just take one of those to there. Okay, good. I'm going to take two of these <clears throat> to the other location. Fine. They don't need anything else there, so um, I think we can actually afford to send the Titan and this to here. Cool. And we're going to send one, two, three to there. And they are going to block. And we're going to send one, two, three, four to here. And then this guy is going to block. All right. Cool. Now, I don't know if we can take both of these this turn, but we'll give it a go because I don't know what's on Yarrow 2 yet. Let's do that first. And we go. <clears throat> okay, standard defences, they've got all the usual things. <clears throat> okay, a little bit more on the planet than I thought. Let's try dropping everything. Hmm. Probably, probably did more damage than I was intending. Uh, we will hold off on landing there for the moment. Let's have a look here. Bloody hell. Also can't land here either. So let's siege both of these. All right. <clears throat> In terms of the Klaxon front, I think that's it. We've got our other main fleet here. And now, have they got transports with them? Mm, no. That's disappointing can we create any here no 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 those are pissant pissant locations with bugger all i see trickle urkel is pretty decent what we got here can we do anything here yeah okay we can 
Let's, let's get five here. It's going to be expensive, but we've got a lot of money right now. 66k, so done. All right. Okay, uh, let's send this guy up here as well. Um, yeah, these guys are going here, aren't they? Let's, let's colonize that planet. Um, again, I'm surprised there hasn't been an Antaran raid yet. Now we're going to build some stuff for these guys. One of those. One of those. Maybe a cloning center now. Um, I can't see it on the list. Maybe it's there already. Okay. Yeah, because I think there's still a load of buildings there, isn't there? Yeah. All right, another star base done. Okay, so that's everything on this front that needs my personal intervention, I think. Move these to here. And then I guess they're coming. Hmm. Well, we'll see can hold there for the moment did we and this has got some pollution so let's build a recycler tron or something there we go a few options there uh, we'll get that one we'll get that one um cool okay all right good 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 all right done Um, and here we are. Mm. Okay. Well, we got a battle going on here. Uh, let's get these guys in first. We're going to take this planet out. Oh, just deploy one. Captured it, finally. One step closer. Okay, advancing on harbour. <clears throat> I've already got one fleet there. Forgot about that. Okay, we'll drop all of those just to knock that shield down a bit. For when the invasion forces come. So here we've got a pretty big invasion force. Let's take them over there. Space battle. Woo. This one's a little bit uh, favourable, but not uh, favourable, but not not guaranteed. I think this is a take command situation. Never trust the never trust the computer um, with favourable. So we've got three battleships, some cruisers. Now the main thing is I need to keep these troop transports out of it. So we're going to send them back straight away, right? Um, I'm going to concentrate our firepower on the batteries first. <coughs> Here we go. There go my troop transports, keeping out the way. Oh, I think the... Um, I think the orbital weapons platform was destroyed already. It's pretty quick. This is taking a lot of punishment. Looks like that's going. Looks like it's going. Yeah. Okay, we just took out another one of his ships there. Looks like that one's trying to get away. Cool. That's a pretty good uh, result for me. Okay, we will attack the colony. I'll risk it. Mm, we took it. That system is mine. Oh, now look at all these people on science duty. Terrible. Let's put you to more productive use immediately. 
Right. Um, and we'll build a star base. We will build an alien management center. And uh, I might even create the Antaran portal generator in this system because it's pretty central. But I'll come back to that decision in a moment. That's how we're going to get through to face the Antarans. So the Mechlon Empire has got a few other colonies, but these are the key, key ones here. Um, mm, let's see if I've got any troop transports nearby for that. Yep, they're, okay, they're coming. All right, they'll be there next turn for enough. Oh, what's all this? Got another fleet here. Okay, so... This guy needs to build. Yeah, don't, don't need one of those, do we? Uh, well, this fleet, I think we'll head up here then. To these systems. Okay, cool. Uh, that's all the combat actions that I can see. Oh, got another battleship here. Yeah, we're, gonna, we're assembling a force here, aren't we? So... Um, getting ready to go into silicoid space um we're also assembling a force here um and in fact oh wow five battleships look at that and <laughs> let's barely put a dent in our command points let's get them to come in um <coughs> i'm gonna buy those <coughs> i think we'll have another five transports from there um so now i want another five of them done and then let's do, yeah, do those as well. And, uh, well, looks good, looks good. All right. Um, okay, general move then. Now we've got some tedious production stuff to do. I will check my phone. Okay, someone is smelling pickles, and uh, Daryl said, nice shooting text. I uh, appreciate that, Daryl. Thank you. <laughs> that, was, that wasn't a burp. That was a space asteroid. Okay. I really think now we're just looking to build the, the biggest, most advanced um, fleet we can to take on the Antarans. Uh, I'm spending 7k, I'm going, earning 7k a month, or turn, whatever. Well, I wish I was in real life. Money, 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 must be funny in a rich man's world. I'll be funny in my world, because I'm not used to having any. Do -do, do -do -do, do -do 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 -do. All the things I could do if I had a little money. I need to watch that ABBA documentary actually sometime. Mm. Okay. All right, next turn. So as you can see, the universe is looking very pink. That's good for me. I am surprised there's not been another Antaran attack, and I wonder if that's because when you get to a victory condition, maybe they become redundant. I don't know.
I mean, I would have thought they still happened, but. Right. Now, or we'll have the uh, class five shield, please. Lovely. I will update all my blueprints. Thank you. Check out the Titan. Look at that. It does look a bit like Battlestar Galactica, don't they? Yeah, I do like that one, but I also love the Titan. Titan is a beast of a ship. Um, okay, good advanced tactics. We don't need it, but upgrade all of those. Okay, so. Oh another turn then here we are waiting to invade now let's get those marines down a little bit damn we're killing the population off here deploy planet is mine what's left of it this one is a bit trickier there's a lot more still to come so what we'll do is we're going to move them over there next turn these guys are mm, no, they're going to just stay there oh, these guys are coming everyone's everyone's going that way Everyone is kung fu fighting. <clears throat> okay. So that's under silicoid control, this planet, I think. Oh, look at that. They've got, that's a fleet there. Capacity of, ooh. Oh, but my fleet's bigger. Shall we go and attack it just for laughs? I think it'd be fun. What do you reckon? <laughs> well, we'll stay there for a minute. But I could take that fleet out, and that's probably his primary fleet, and that would that would cripple him straight away. Um, right, that guy is repairing. Okay. Um. Yeah, so there's definitely some in, some internal security we can do away with. We can scrap that. Um, anything between these two systems, yeah, we can scrap. Oh, no, that's protecting the wormhole, so not that one. Um, yeah, probably. I think probably this, probably that one, probably that one, but... It's not like anyone's going to be able to conduct an offensive, but I don't want to get complacent at the same time. Right, let's continue our campaign here. We are taking out... I think three's enough. Done. This system has fallen. Mechlon homeworld system is completely now mine. <clears throat> okay, this fleet's arrived up here. Got some Mechlar forces here. First, we've got to take that out. Right. Good, good. Uh, let's get these up here. Yeah, they shouldn't travel on their own, so we'll keep them together. Attack this again. Okay. Let's 
besiege that. Well, yeah, we have done okay. Uh, this guy is going to come down here. Uh, this guy probably going to go. Yeah, I might take these this way actually. What's that? Is that? That's a Metclar outpost. Let's take that out. And we'll head up this way. Okay. Choose production then, and I'll check the chat in just a sec. <coughs> oh dear. Hmm. Yeah. It does feel like the uh, the lance lance life expectancy is grow short. Hmm. Anyway, as long as I spend my time with you guys hanging out and having fun, that's all you can do in it. That's all you can do. All right, I'm going to pop that on there. Let's do that. Ah. Ah. Always look on the bright side of life. Do -do 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 -do. Always look on the bright. Side and light. Do 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 do. Life is not a ball. You're born with bugger all. Da 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 which will take ages. So I think probably what I'll do is build up some good border defences. Oh, look, we got that weird line again. Why? Um, and then, you know, yeah, and and um, then I'll probably build it somewhere around like Farasa or, um, yeah, Mechlon, somewhere around here. It's got a lot of fleets here. But, and then stuff can come to this wormhole, I guess. That's one way of getting it there. People, there's loads of jump gates though. So, yeah, how big is this fleet here? Oh, nothing to worry about. All right. Um, we've got a little fleet here, haven't we? Yeah. We've got about these guys. Now well, they are going to come up here. Choose production. <clears throat> now we'll be checking on the chat in just a sec. Yeah, so for us, I'll tell you what. Let's um, build um, five of these. Done. Gonna start building up fleet there. Uh, really? Have some subterranean farms, I'll pay for them. There you go. Don't want you dying now, do we? And a cloning center. Get you some buddies so you're not all on your own. What else we got? I think the next term will be quite defining. Mechlon has now been conquered. One of them. One of them. One of them. Um, yeah, one of them would be useful too, actually. Okay. Done. What else? Fleet needs orders. Okay, these guys are travelling up to here. Troop transports. <coughs> Can we attack with this? No, not yet. Wait for them to get there, I think. Uh. Nah, that's better. 
and that's it's not a small fleet that but even though my number of ships is not that much bigger than his it's just the technology i think i'm outclassing him with the type of weapons and things i have so right here we are gathering a force now this is a border defense force basically okay i'm gonna dash to the toilets and as uh we go to next turn uh oh space asteroid <coughs> so um yeah, that might, might give you an indication as to why that's a wise decision for me. Um, I'm going to take them to there. All right. Okay. Well, that one's done, is it? Okay. Um, look at the pollution on these two planets here. Can we... Can we do anything about that? Nope, they've already got maximum stuff happening. What about this one? Oh, I guess we can take some, some of these off, reduce the pollution a, a little bit, and then... No, they've already got all the maximum doodars. Okay. Pollution. Yeah, let's buy that. Maybe put some of these. So it's not, you know, quite so pollution heavy. Should knock it down a little bit. Anything else we can buy that's anti-pollution? Um, some to the recyclotron, aren't we? Anyway? Maybe they've got that already. Okay, done. Fleet. Mm. It's so tedious. Yeah, that can stay there. All right, next turn. Okay, guys. So we're going to go next turn. Go for a pee, and then I will come back and look at the chat. Right, okay. We are back. Oh yes, chat. See how the chat is coming. Outcast hoodie. Yeah. We need to uh not to mention all the other races united together to beat you or him. Do you have to protect the systems or take them over? No, you take them over. I mean, technically, they fall under your protection once you've taken them over, if you follow me. It's a, a bit of a nuanced uh, discussion, that. Um, right, I've now got the chat in front of me so I can can see what's happening. I've done time in FBI jail. Hmm. <clears throat> it's amazing how many convicts I've met on YouTube. Right. Next turn. Bringing this guy to here. Oh, we're bringing this fleet to here. And these. So it's just going to take this out again. Drop that again. Let's pattern that a little bit more. Okay. Meanwhile, up here, 
Mm, look at this. With the, he's got a Titan here, look. Ah, let's go for it. Well, look at this, guys. I think take command. <coughs> There's the Titan, the Mechlon, Mechlon Titan. Okay, right. So, where's my space factory? So, forget. Yeah, the thing that this is a bit worrying. I've my my numbers of ships is oh what the fuck no, i've done that weird thing with the map again haven't i okay right looks like i can't actually control all my shit so i'm just uh doing what i always do try and take out their their stuff all right here we go coming straight in at me with his ships. I know that this one's going to be a foregone conclusion. The orbital batteries have gone. That's good. Oh, we lost a ship there. Definitely lost a ship then. Okay, looks like that's going to go. So I'm going to get all of these to focus on this. Yeah, we've lost a few ships. Look at that. There's quite, quite a few of our ships have gone. Oh, there goes another one. There goes another one. Uh, everything on this Titan. Got to take that Titan out. Yeah, I think we got there. We got the Titan. There it goes. Ooh, not without. Hey, we, oh, there goes my cruiser. See that? Look, he tried to, do you see that? He tried to jump out, but he can't, can't jump out. I've got some kind of technology that blocks that, I think. All right. That was a hard fought victory. Hey, to Thomas Baholi um, takes over the universe, which is uh, uncontrollably. Yeah. Hey, how are you? Good to see you, Thomas. Let's see how many casualties I think I lost. Oh, look at that. I lost a cruiser. I don't know if I lost that battleship. It's battered anyway. And three destroyers, two frigates. Yeah, I lost uh, quite a lot there. We'll drop all of these. We won't get through the shield though. Okay, and we'll siege this planet. <clears throat> and uh, we need more forces coming up there. So uh, this fleet uh, needs to come up here. So. All right. Um. Yep. Can I say that's probably one of our combat moves? Just check here. Oh yeah. Hold oh, on. Got this one. Right, we're gonna we're gonna invade this turn. Yeah, it's ours. The Claxons are defeated. Our numbers have failed. Many as we are, we stand to be exterminated. Yep. Oh, that'll be a news item now, I think. Okay. Yeah, repair, upgrade, all of that stuff. Let's uh minus ten food. I don't think so. Let's get some things in operation here. We'll do one of those, one of these. Um get a star base going. <coughs> Oh, right. This is why it's minus 10, because those are more strike. Oh, I'm sorry your war got, your world got conquered, but you know. Uh, 
Right, there you go. No, you're not going to starve now, are you? Right. Mm, no. I thought I could... Sometimes you can take out a scout ship and sort of no one notices. Um, but I guess those times are over. <laughs> All right. Um... All right. Here we're talking about maybe attacking this silicoid fleet. So, hang on. Oh, what's changed here? He's built something. He's now on 932, right. Oh, hang on. That's the wrong thing. Yeah, okay, that's better. Let's do it. Okay, guys, this will be the biggest space battle to date. Oh, but for whatever reason, I can't bring those guys in. Oh, I'm going to wait. Um, where am I? Let's have a look. Whew, look at that. Pretty cool, right? Let's do it. Fuck it. We're declaring war on the silicoid. Okay, so this is, guys, this is going to be proper monstrous. So many ships. Look at that. First time we've seen their fleets. All right. All right. Interesting. Okay. Is that a ship? Oh, God, it is. That's a ship. Didn't realise that. That's a big ship, too. Thought that was a rock. Right, let's do this. Oh, they're funny-looking vessels. Look at this. Uh, this is a big, this is a big space battle, this, guys. Pew, 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 pew. Fire off phases. Okay. Oh, something got destroyed straight away there. I don't know if that was mine or his. Okay, I think I think I see a few of his ships going down. Oh yeah, there goes another one. Let's, let's go to here. Oh, it's pretty difficult to tell what's going on. Um, go back to cinematic. Something just went there. Nothing that was one of mine. That was one of his. Look at my destroyers acting as a group. Uh, we just took out his battleship and his leader. another one look at this little ship here look that, that, those are frigates i think oh there goes that one i think that's it yeah let's see how many ships i lost damn i lost one ship 
and he lost everything. Whew. Oh, I'm not going to destroy that. Okay, it looks like uh, something escaped, just the troop transport. We'll see to that. Um, okay, well, why don't we try and negotiate with him and ask for this planet? Let's see if we can have peace. Okay, <laughs> he doesn't want to talk to me, probably because I just um, destroyed his entire fleet. Um, hey, Magnificent 7-7, seven, seven. Moo has really changed over the years. You're welcome to the channel, man. I've not seen you comment before. Um, by the way, um, I wrote the stage play about the making of the magnificent seven it's it's never happened sadly i'd really like to put it on soon um but um yeah i don't know when that will happen uh, if, it, if it will happen at all um right let's see For a minute what defenses does he have there quite a bit okay one at a time then okay so what's happening up here let's have a look at this planet no we're just besieging that are we okay um i see he's already <laughs> building defenses uh, this is why i really want to come at him from this other direction as well so let's bring these guys up this way um oh yeah we're at war with silicoids now aren't we so um i guess we can all point blocked oh wait a minute oh what, what's this then it's a mechlar thing okay actually do you know what i'll leave that Could go have an alliance, couldn't I, with the, um, I don't know about, does that give him open borders? I don't want to give him open borders. Right. So I reckon this location is a good place to build the Antaran jump gate. So we're going to start building it now. Um, yeah, for Rasa. Okay, let's look at this. That looks okay. Rasa looks good. Um, right. I think that's probably it. Must be some production stuff to do. Um, yeah, get more ships being made for our attack on the Antaran system. Um, some of these planets are well over mined. Okay, 71,000 in the bank, that's obscene. It's funny how all the Meklon planets are all like got pollution and they're all um, overworked. Uh, let's have a look at the chat here. So 
sorry to hear that your play's not been done. Yeah, no, it's called Seven Magnificent Egos. Um, used to play Moo back in the day. I don't know that game. Used to play another resource build. Oh, Ascendancy. I remember selling that in the game shop I used to work in. That definitely was um, that definitely was a game, mate. Yeah, Ascendancy. I remember it for sure. Um, so if we're gonna if we're gonna build that Antar and Dudar thing here, then we need. Um, oh, we've got one jump gate there. The more jump gates we've got near that, the better, isn't it? So we're gonna build one here as well. Okay. Um, I think we better get some troop transports here as well. Um, yeah, let's buy those and let's get another five on the go. Done. Uh, and done. I think these orders... Yeah, got so many ships now all over the bloody place. Right. I think these were going to take this out, weren't they? Um, oh, no, they're going to upgrade. Very good. That's one of mine. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> this guy is going to build a jump gate here. Okay. These guys are going to jump too. Actually, I'm going to start gathering my forces for this Antar and jump, so I'm going to start bringing everybody into this place. Um, actually, I'll even bring him. Let's get another robot up there. Okay, next turn. Cooking on gas, people. Let me check the chat. Moo was called. Oh, Moo is what we called Master Run. Ah, oh, right. Sorry, mate. Okay, yeah. Cool. Still, Homer Simpson moment. Had a tech tree. Yeah. Um, you've got a tech. You've got a technology tree here as well. It's not quite the same layout as Ascendancy. <laughs> 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 Yeah, I remember Ascendancy came in like a big box. I might do um, a read-through of my Magnificent 7 play sometime online. Mm. Mm. Kill him. And, um, let's make sure we've got Lots of anti-espionage. Oh, yeah, I've got like a shitload of captured spies, haven't I? Oh, well, I had loads more, but I guess they've all been executed now since those those uh, those nations no longer exist. Maybe they'd be, maybe we freed them, sent them home in a sort of care package type situation. All right, let's try and take this out. Oh, look at that. I like to show you these space battles. Good fun. Let's see it. Here we go. Oh, I'm going to do this on auto. Looks like my ships are doing the big flanking tactic. <clears throat> 
great if you could get a Star Trek version of this, wouldn't it? I'm not talking about Star Trek Online. I'm Mike Seven. You don't have a, a personal computer anymore. Just got your phone. Okay. So let's drop all bombs. Uh, not quite enough. Resisted the invasion. Yeah, that was a gamble. I could see that. Um, but, you know. I'm less interested in capturing these colonies intact. Right, this is interesting. Got a little fleet there. All right, this is quite a little little small fleet action here. Um, yeah, let's focus everything on. Okay. Incoming. Focus fire on that star base. Yeah, that's just a star base. That's not a. That's not the bigger one. Incoming uh, fight on torpedo. Now we've got to take out the ships. No, I'll take this one out first. Okay, fine. Yeah, one of my one of my guys is pretty battered there, look. pressure on even that was a tiny fleet just goes to show how much better my technology is look at this outpost over here oh hello oh look at that someone's been hiding a big big fleet here well we're gonna have to take care of that fleet aren't we right i see the way to get there I do see the way. This guy's going to have to build a outpost. Let's seal that off. Yeah, I'm not going to go like yomping around all that lot. Um, I thought there would be a, a jump gate there, but there isn't. Surprisingly. Okay, you sir, come here, thank you, and then if you would come to here, there we go, right, and then, this is my fleet that um, decimated his uh, just now, I'm going to send that into there. Oh, I see. Well, let's just make them a one fleet. Next time we'll send them in there. Okay. Ah, uh, advanced military outpost. Cool. Uh, let's do this one. Keep going.
Yeah, Sussler's a quite a good construction planet. Let's go with that. Go with that. And uh, I'll go. I'll do for now. Need to blow me those again. If I put my telly on in the background, if you guys can hear it. <laughs> the bombardment scene reminds me of the scene when B5 Centauri bombed Narn. Now, I'm a huge Babylon 5 fan. Um, yeah, do you know what? I reckon if I had a person helping me produce consolidate and promote all of my all of my stuff my books my plays my channel and everything together i reckon you know we could uh make some moolah there unfortunately i'm a bit of a one-man army so i'm not so good with doing all that stuff on my own it's quite a lot to do on your own <clears throat> so we're going to continue building ships, basically. I think we'll get five frigates there. Right, come on now. Oh, okay. Um, oh, yeah, another jump gate just here. Because we want to build lots of jump gates within easy reach of... Fazra or Fazra or whatever it's called. Um, yeah, We've got one there. But we'd be, it would be better off if it was here. Though. Um, so, yeah, because this is where we're building the Antaran jump gate. Actually, we'll buy and pay for those now. What we got here? Pay for those now. And uh, I think we'll build another five of them. Okay. I reckon on this stream tonight we might get the um, the Antaran space battle. I might do that. I might log off the stream and come back on again. Because I might just label that. Because people will probably be interested in just seeing that. Who've played this game before. Well, there's a new Gillian Anderson show coming on Friday. Scoop. I wonder if that's any good. Something to do with the president, maybe. Yeah. Okay. Let's put this back on. Yeah, you guys can. You guys. You guys can probably hear that, can't you? That's, that's, I better. I better pause that. Okay. So now I'm a bad boy. Very, very bad. Gay okay, Keith, I don't need to know about your proclivities during the stream. Um, there are ladies who you can pay money to address those bad things for you. Right, let's move all this over there. Why are these guys not moving when I move them? What's up with this? Okay, fleet needs orders. Oh, is it still, it's still the same turn, isn't it? It's still the same turn. Um... Okay, clean these orders, of course. Right, yeah, okay. <clears throat> Meklon. Right, this guy is gonna go here, I guess. All right, now. How are we doing here? How many how many troop transports we got there? Just the two. Sucks. Okay. Now we've also got that fleet of his, which is here. Um, to get to it is via Pandora, or we come through this one. Um, we'll see. Okay. Right, 
these five battleships are going to come to here. Okay. Fleet needs orders. Too many fleets, man. Yeah, these are already going to start their way over here. Okay. It's all these troop transports I created to help out with the invasion and stuff here. Okay, next turn, here we go. How much Lance charge you? No, I proxy my spanking to Lance. <laughs> What? what? <laughs> this has taken a whole strange turn. Um, so, uh... <laughs> oh, Sandy's here. Hey, Sandy. How you doing? Didn't see you there. Um, oh, yeah. You say Babylon 5. Here I am. Oh, right. I didn't know you were a big Babylon 5 fan. Oh, I'm a huge B5 fan. I... I Try to design a board game sort of set in that universe. I know they've been trying to reboot it, and <clears throat> I mean, it would benefit from having new effects and everything, but there is something very cute about the uh, original series, you know, the way it looks and stuff. Um, but um, yeah, well, I'm now at war with everybody except for the um, um, Alkiri, which are the guys in yellow. Um, because I had an opportunity to just destroy the silicoid fleet. I took it, took his entire fleet out, which was here. Right, I believe these guys can now get there. Yeah, okay. Let's attack this. And, uh, right. take these. Have we, got, have we got a space factory there? No. Okay. Um, is there any, any troop transports anywhere? No. Uh, I don't want to do with this guy. Alright, that's now finito. that guy going? Yeah, okay. All right. Right, so let's get to the war front. Here we are. Sasonia. Ooh. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, let's take out that jump gate. Jump gates in this are like exactly the same as the jump gates in Babylon 5, basically. Four just devastated that. <coughs> I'm reducing his um, financial uh, infrastructure so that. Uh, he won't be able to spend much money. Let's get this one in there. Let's take this down. Let's take this one out. I'm going to capture this one, I hope. Uh, right, well, we're going to have to do this first. That is not enough men to take out that. So we're going to wait on that. We're going to siege it. Okay. These guys are going to come up here then. All right, gotta get some more of these. Let's do another five troop transport. So, um, I think I'm going to get to go to the Antaran system if I can keep playing this quickly enough. Um, let's just check the chat. Can't get a job teaching in the English speaking world. Yeah, well, tell me about it. 
Oh, the last video you watched was Antietam. Okay, yeah, I think uh, Sandy was on Antietam with that. That was a military diplomatic history and eternal affairs history guy. Oh, you on the architectural history of the Embassy of Australia in Washington. Well, at least it's a job. Pays money. I would hope. Um, yeah, I had a tough night last night. I had a two-hour conversation with the ex-wife. I mean, it was, you know... I mean, we 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 we're very civil with each other, and uh, but it just you know, just brings up all this stuff, and it's very it just when you come off the phone, you're like a bit of an emotional wreck, and uh, I found that really hard last night, so I was a bit of a mess. Um, but you know, we have some property we own in Africa, so sometimes these conversations have to happen. Um, right, let's do the standard move. Get everyone moving that's moving see all the little arrows zooming along okay let's choose production it's done here or gone or whatever okay got five i'm building ships in in batches of five now even battleships in batches of five can you believe it um Blucher. Yeah, I do. I want to go and wipe out that that um, force. Oh, not that one. I want to go and wipe out that Mechlar force. That's so he's going to go there, and then he's going to jump from there to. Well, we haven't got a jump gate there yet, so that's also to here then. Okay. Right, this guy's now making a jump gate. Okay, good. What's this guy got? Can you make anything? <laughs> no. Okay. Yeah, we need more, more troop transports. These guys can probably make something, can't they? Yeah, of course you can. All right, good, good, good. All right, let's get five troop transports. Okay, good. I'll pay for those, thank you very much. And let's have five from here. Oh, there you go. Pay for those. And then we'll have uh, five more. All right. Okay, done. Um, Trade goods, that's fine. And then, what else we got? Okay, done, done, done. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Right, you know, these guys, <clears throat> they're actually going to jump to here because they, they can go and take on that force. That's a good fleet, that. Yeah. And they can do an upgrade on the way, which I think they need to do. Okay, good. Okay, the Farsa Brigade. Um, they're just going to hang out with these guys because that's going to be the Antaran battle fleet ultimately because that's where we're building it okay we've got some troop transports here um no they're just part of that yeah that fleet these ones however are going to come down here okay all right Look at that. Next turn. Let's check the chat. Um, uh, 
I'm just reading about the chat here. Someone's put a YouTube link in. I'm sure that's cool. Most embassies in Washington were abandoned mansions left to rot after the Depression when the foreign governments moved in. It saved them. Uh, okay, the French embassy is really disappointing. It looks much better behind the gates. <laughs> French embassy, do not take any Muppets with you. You have been warned. Oh, look, we've got a battle. Unfavorable odds. Right, uh, we can retreat actually, so let's, should we do that? Yeah. All right, one of my ships escaped, one of them was destroyed. No, oh, no, I think we both got destroyed. Where was that then? Oh, right, those are those guys that were... Okay, I see what happened there. Population boom, yeah, very exciting. All right. Um, okay. Let's see if we can get how many of these tank things we can get rid of. These battle mechs. Once I knock out another another battle mech. Oh, there we go. Deploy. Planet is mine. Right, okay, good. Now, straight away, take this guy. He's going to go there in a minute. Um, we will build a star base immediately, pay for that. Okay. Right, let's just look what other battles we have to do. We've got harbour here. Still waiting on got troop transports coming down here with these guys. Um, these guys are kind of waiting, so I'll put them in a blocking position. Um, I think that's it in terms of other fighting, because over here, the fighting's kind of ended. Um, I really need this force to come home, so I think what we'll do is bring them to here. This guy, the space factory, will come here. We'll have him build a outpost, an advanced military outpost even. And this guy will come back to there, and then we'll jump point him to be with the rest of them. Let's do the moves. <clears throat> I need a strong force to get to Oculus because I've got to go through two systems. Either we'll go through this system or this system to get to it. Um, I have a feeling that this system will be easier. Mm. Okay, I'm just going to put this on money. Okay, done. Cheese production. Mm. Let's, um, let's build another Titan. Okay, the only thing I'm not building in batches of five are Titans. So we're going to need a lot of Titans to take on that. Right. And you know, the best way to take on the um, Antarans is to send a little ship through first. You can see what you're up against. And then... Um, you send in your main force, basically. Okay, rendezvousing there then. So uh, I've got to cut what's this? Okay, that's fine. Yep. Anything else random stuck somewhere? What's that there? 
I'll check the chat again in a minute just to see. But those people watching, I appreciate you hanging out with me. Um, I'm just going to bombard this again. Slowly being destroyed there. Won't be much of it left for me to, to capture at this rate. Um, yeah, they're all waiting to come down. Ah, oh, we'll leave that one. We'll have bought that one. Okay. Um, these guys are going to come up to here. Did I move them? Not yet. Oh, yeah, I captured that, didn't I? Upgrade everything. Okay. Um, so let's hang fire on that because we might want to Move them to here. Capture that next. Okay. Cheese production. Hang on, let's see where it was. That is a fire. Oh, it's that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. Mm, the, the Versailles, Versailles, Vasily battle is one of the most mean something. Hey, does it, Phoenix? How are you doing? British Embassy in Paris has an interesting story, does it now? Um, Bob is the link to Sandy's thing, yeah. I mean, we should always have a link to Sandy's thing. That's very important. Um, whatever the thing may be. All right. This is this game is getting a bit tedious now, so we need to sort of move things along a bit. Um, <clears throat> takes a long, takes a long. Let's get these up here. All oh, right, he's he's done. Okay, cool. Mm. God, my PC is like positively groaning. So I'm. Mm, 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 mm. You know, I dread dread the day it just suddenly gives up the ghost, you know. Right. Oh, this fleet, yeah, well now. We need to leave a little fleet here. That's fine. So fleet A can come back to here. Do we have another space fort? I don't think we do. That one's building, so yeah, okay. So they're going to here then. Incoming! Oh. Space asteroid. Gotta watch out for those ray shields. Um. See, this is, the problem is I can't hit, I can't hit the mute button. <laughs> I'm playing this because I can't see the mute button because all I can see on my computer is what you can see. Um, I can't actually... Yeah, PCs can hear you. Yeah, I'm sure it heard that. <clears throat> okay, threatening fleet detected. wonder what, which ones he's talking about. There's quite a lot going on up here, isn't there? Yeah, that's another Mechlar stronghold. Right. Okay, so, got a few things I want to do here. First of all, Titan's going to go here. Okay, we're going to trance that. Right. Let's dispatch one battleship. Oh, he's damaged to here. with another Titan and a few small ships. 
That should be enough. Yeah. Right, now these can come in here. These can... Uh, I'm going to take this one. Put it here. You're going to build a jump gate. Keep going on that. Rest of you up here. Okay. Uh, I'm glad to see that the uh, space asteroid has passed without comment. Okay, well, I'll just auto resolve this. Attack the colony. Yeah, I think we'll be alright. Let's drop all of those and then let's deploy. Yeah. This system is ours. Okay, cool. And then they'll, they'll be going up there. Right. Okay. Um, <clears throat> yeah, let's see if we can build some. Uh, marine ships? No, we can't because I'm guessing we haven't got a barracks because we probably just destroyed it. Uh, looking to see what they have got. Okay, well, let's do that. We'll get that first. Again, then we'll get one of these. And uh, we'll take it from there. Alright, next colony. And this is the other one. And this must have... Um, Oh yeah, we go. All right. All right. Move. Research time. Deep core nine or core waste dump. Core waste dump. I think because we've got quite a few planets that are needing one. Um, oh wow! Look at all this galactic economics. Yeah, I've already sorted that. Uh, I kicked ass on that earlier. Star fortress. Sounds good. Okay, now. Um, we had a couple of planets that are... These guys have got mega pollution, right? So now what we can do is build one of them. That will help reduce that considerably. Might also just you know, take a couple of people off as well. Um... Do the same with this. Um, there it is. Do you call waste dump? After that, I'm going to have them build a Titan. Right. Done. Now, if we go to here, right, there's the Antaran generator. I'm going to pay for it now. So it's there. I'm going to build another Titan. Um, You'll see it in a minute. It'll probably materialise at the end of this go. Uh, so, right, let's do this. Okay. Right, fine. Okay, so it's not ready to do that yet. Right, this guy, bring him to here. Um. Get this guy here, blow that up. Can't build stuff if he's got a node there. Check in the chat. Gotta go. Oh, okay. Cheers, Sandy. Lo always lovely to see you. Thank you for um, and you for popping in. Much appreciated. Um, okay. Sure. Yeah, lots of people waiting on this um, Antaran doodah. Yeah, these are coming down here, aren't they? Okay. These are also coming down here. Mm, okay. Right, zoom out. <clears throat> Next turn. Damn, it's three o'clock. I um, can't stay up too much later, but... Uh, it would be, oh, I was hoping to do the Antaran jump tonight, but that might have to be tomorrow. Might have to be tomorrow. After Shogun. <coughs> Guess we're preparing for it. That guy is heading home. No, oh, it's not my turn, is it? Okay, I'll probably play one more turn of this and then I think I'll call it a night. So, 
Oh, look, there we go. There's the Antaran portal. See that? Right, so I'm going to show you guys while you're here what's on the other side. Let's send a destroyer in. Just the one. And I'll, I'll show you. In the meantime, all the other forces are gathering. Take him on now. Troop transports, I want to put in a slightly different place, put them here. Um, something that was damaged wasn't there oh maybe it just looked like that was it one of these oh no okay um, i'm going to bring these here in case there's any upgrades to do no nope, okay <coughs> oh dear I feel old, Gandalf. Okay. Right, we're coming in to take him out here. He's got a bit of a fleet there, but nothing to concern ourselves with. Um, I don't think I'm going to need these guys, to be honest. I do need troop transports though, so can we have some please? Uh, let's see. Yes, we can. A bit, a bit more expensive here, but that's fine. Okay. I was banned from Willow World. <laughs> I've already got a whole thing prepared for you guys for that tomorrow. Don't you worry about that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, well, fatigue is hitting me now, so I probably will head off in a sec. Um, let me do this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play it up to the point where I can send that guy through just so you guys can see um, exactly what's on the other side. I want to show you. Okay. Right. Um, going to there. And then these guys are going to jump gate down to the same place. Okay. Peace reduction. Oh, right. This one's also polluting the hell out of itself. Um, oh, there's nothing I can. I will build a Titan. Very good. Lots of Titans being constructed at the moment. And that can just go on trade goods. Mm. Um. Oh, we aren't. Yeah, we're waiting to. Waiting to get, uh, just hang out there, that's fine. Right, they're waiting for the rest to catch up, aren't they? That's going to hang there. That is, um, going to jump. Not sure where to yet. Let's move this guy down here, so he can build a jump gate there. Now, I wanted to get these closer to this, but I don't think I can move them to here, I suppose. But actually, you know what, let's just, let's just bring them to Farasa. Oh, 
Okay, right, it's next turn. So I'm going to just take that ship through on the next bit so you can see. And uh, you'll get to see what it's like on the other side of that. And then we'll call it a night. Okay, so I was just uh, brushing my teeth, guys, so I can jump into bed as soon as I've done with this. Right, okay, so let me show you how this works. This is the Antaran portal. Right, so I can send this guy through, I think. Hmm. I can't jump through to the Antaran portal. Why not? Well, it's probably, you know what? It's probably because all the other victory conditions or one of the other victory conditions has been met already. And that's why I can't jump through there. Um, do I need to do something else? No, I don't think so. Yeah, I think it's because um, Yeah, I mean, I basically won the game um, This is the grass of the other races um, uh, um but I, ah, oh, that's a shame because now I can't actually, there's no point playing the rest of the game really because um, what I wanted to do is I wanted to go through here. I mean, unless maybe destroyers are not, no, of course they can. Let me just try with another ship. Hang on. I, I don't think it's going to make any difference. No. So <clears throat> when you jump through there, the Antaran fleet is on the other side and you've got to try and you can destroy it and that's another way you can win the the game um but this is all bit moot now because oh, i'm i'm going to easily win this now 
and I, I did wonder why there hadn't been any more Antaran attacks. So, oh, that's kind of disappointing, man. I wanted to wanted to show you guys uh, that. Okay, well, guess that's it then. So we're going to call it there. Just check the chat before I. Um, Okay, seven people watching. Cool, that's nice. Um, nice to see you. Uh, if anybody knows different, um, let me know because obviously I'll carry on playing if um, I can get through to that world. But I think because I already fulfilled a different victory condition, that that is now moot. At least that's what it seems like to me. So, uh, yeah, it's a bit annoying. Let's check out some of the... Let's just have a look and see who's been on this stream. So we've had Daryl, of course, always popping in. Um, a big conversation earlier about Keith getting bad, you know, because Keith is just so... Can't take him anywhere, you know. I have 26 subscribers and no content. I know. It's great, isn't it, man? CLS Studio popped in. Good to see you, mate. Um... Thomas, good to see you again, buddy. The Master Babbler. Okay. Magnificent Seven was good to have you on. Thank you. Um, I don't remember seeing you in chat before, but you have apparently been here before, so I appreciate that. Darth Plato, of course. Here he is. Not not been banned yet. How much Lance charge you? Oh, oof. do a good rate. Me love you long time. Also a Babylon 5 fan. Good to know, mate. Good to know. Big discussion going on. Um, yeah, okay, cool. So um, tomorrow, Shogun. If you're not watching Shogun, watch it. It's an amazing show, guys. It's amazing. Um, but yeah, <coughs> uh, here's something to make you laugh before I go to bed, if you haven't seen it already. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow night, 10 p.m. UK, 5 p.m. East Coast, 2 p.m. West Coast for Shogun Review, episode 8877, seven, episode 7. Okay, we're ready? Sorry, makeup is just um, helping me out there. No, that's okay, honey. Okay, quiet on set. Action. Uh, uh, oh, I, I, I don't, don't feel very well. No, you go with it, honey. This is working. It's great. Um, Oh my god, that was disgusting. I love it. Okay, can we channel Beyonce and my therapist? You haven't met her, but think sexy. Okay, five, six, seven, eight. Music's not playing. Oh. I've played Ophelia, darling, sung arias, and mumbled on several Christopher Nolan movies. And you want me to play a, a what? Uh, where are you going? 